नमाम्यहम तं सूर्यम प्रणमाम्यहम सुभम भूयात इपुरु जोत प्रज्वलन चेष्टिंदी ये मनी कृष्ण शास्त्री गारी पुत्री कलु कल्याणी गारु देवी रावण मूर्ति गारु पद्मनी गारु वारे कुटुंब सब जुले इवाला ज्योति प्रज्वलन जैसी वारे नाना गार की वारे ताता गार के नमस्कार जेठ वाले जी माँ भाग जंगा भाविस्तुनाम यंतो सुधीनम सक्कटी वीणा कचेरी वारु गुरुवे ने विंचन सिस्टल अनिपित कुंटा रंडे वीरु ये मन संकर सास्त्री गार जगर नेत्र कुंटे टेंट वीणा भाग जंगा ने वारु देवी रमण सिंगर रम Dewi Ramana Murti Garu, wari purici, prasna kita mpadi, wari gurinci, nalgu, wakyalu, ini mana Shankar Shastri Garu gurinci nalgu, wakyalu makku, telih pertawar senda koru kuntu nana. Gaayi Jagavantan Gaayi Ganapati Jagavantan Shankara Suvana Bhavani Kenandan Shankara Suvana Bhavani Kenandan Gaayi Ganapati Jagavandana Sethi Sadana Gaja Vadana Vinayaka Sethi Sadana Gaja Vadana Vinayaka Kripa Sindhu Sundar सब लायक कृपा सिंधु सुंदर सब लायक सुंदर सब लायक गाये गणपति जगवंदन मोद कप्रिया मोद मंगल दाता मोद कप्रिया मोद मंगल दाता विध्यावारिधि बुद्धि विधाता विध्यावा बुद्धि विधाता बुद्धि विधाता गाये गणपति जगवंदन मांगत तुलसीदास कर जो मांगत तुलसीदास कर जोरे बस हुराम सिया मान समूरे बस हुराम सिया मान समूरे मान समूरे गाये गणपति 
जगवंदन शंकर सुवन भवानी के नंदन गाये गणपति जगवंदन नमस्कार भारतीय कला समिति टेक्स द प्राइड ऑफ सेलिब्रेटिंग द सेंटेनरी सेलिब्रेशंस ऑफ महामहो उपाध्याय पद्मश्री ईमनी शंकर शास्त्री गारोज सेंटेनरी सेलिब्रेशंस ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ द समिति ईमनी कृष्ण गारो and all the members who are associated with the samiti and as the daughters of imani shankar shastri garu imani kalyani lakshmi narayana padmini pasumarthi and myself devi ramana murthy welcome you all for today's centenary celebrations of our beloved father imani shankar shastri garu before we begin the program i like to tell you about the the family history the achievements and the awards of imani shankar shastri garu imani shankar shastri was born on 23rd september 1922 at draksharamam a village in east godavari district of andhra pradesh he was from a family of celebrated classical musicians his father vainika bhushana veena acharya imani achutrama shastri a famed vainika and sastragya was a contemporary of sangameshwara shastri and veena venkada ramanayya das of andhra pradesh the prodigious training he had from childhood under his inspiring guru his father reflected in abundance in his scholarly and technic perfect concerts his graceful playing on the veena was traditional and highly innovative a style that evoked a reverential listening he was fondly known as imani a top ranking musician and an outstanding veena master imani was of his times gave concerts throughout the length and breadth of the country and abroad his participation in the east west music festival thansen festival ars national programs of music Vishnu Digambar Festival, Sur Singha's Hari Das Sangeet Sammelan, and other prestigious music conferences won him distinction in the field of music. To him goes the credit of bringing Veena to its place of pride and established a distinctive style of his own. Quite at home with the Hindustani musical system also, Imani played duets with Pandit Ravi Shankar, Ustad Halim Zafar Khan on the sitar, Shri Gopal Krishna on Vichitra Veena, and Amjad Ali Khan on Sarod, evoking enthusiastic response from the North Indian listeners and in programs of national integration. All these brought out similarities of both the systems of music, thus bringing the North and south closer in the field of music his research on gamakas the life and soul of indian music 
had added new dimensions to his music. The results of his researches could be discerned in his playing of various ragas, rendered with clarity and precision. Each type of gamaka emerges with a degree of intensity, tempo, and a range peculiar to a raga, investing it with beauty and vigor. He could accomplish this through understanding and practice of both the vocal and instrumental techniques. Imani was also a composer and director of distinction. After completing his graduation from Andhra University, he joined the famous Gemini Studios at Madras, where he was the music director for more than 10 years. He composed lilting tunes based on novel techniques and directed music for film hits like Mangala, Sansar, Bahuddin Hue, Nishan, Mr. Sampath, and English version of Chandralekha. His own compositions of Kirtanas, Javalis, and Bhajans could be frequently heard in his solo concerts. His operas in the regional languages were also very popular. To name one, it is Nauka Charitra from All India Radio. <laughs> Imani joined All India Radio in 1959 as producer of music at Madras. Soon he rose to the position of director and composer of national orchestra and chief producer of music. He presented over the broadcasting network a number of classical, thematic, orchestral compositions and folk melodies, bringing out the special tonal qualities of Indian instruments and synthesized musical patterns with a distinctive Imani mark. To mention a few monumental works in orchestration, the first one being Adar Sikhar Rohanam, an orchestral composition based on the theme of the conquest of Mount Everest in which he used six veenas. The force proved a unique experience to lovers of creative music. It opened up new vistas of musical utterance. Swara Tarangini, an orchestral composition in which he employed numerous sounds that gradually crystallize into musical swaras, suggesting the origin of sound and music. Ragam Tanam Pallavi, an orchestral composition based on the classical raga Todi. It was an experiment first of its kind in classical music, which won the appreciation of musicians, music scholars, and listeners. Indu, a composition based on the first six ragas of the first chakra of the Melakarta, scheme of the great Venkatamakhi. Saumya Purush, a musical composition on our national father, late Mahatma Gandhiji's ideals. Bharata Jyoti, a thematic musical composition on late Pandit Nehru, our beloved Prime Minister and his achievements. Brahmaravinyas, a thematic composition depicting a day in the life of a bee which won laurels at the Italian rostrum. Imani was also associated with cultural and academic organizations. He was the Asthan Vidwan of Tirupati Devasthanam, member of the University Grants Committee, Music Academy, Madras. He was the designated founder member of the International Music Festival, Paris, and chairman of the committee to select candidates for scholarships of the Education Ministry for Carnatic Music. He was on the national jury to select films for awards and was a member of Central Sangeet Natak Academy to select candidates for the national awards. He received innumerable titles, honors, and awards for his outstanding contribution in the field of music.
they're literally innumerable, so I may not be able to speak out or tell you all the awards that he has won, but I will tell you a few of the important awards that he has won. Vainika Sikhamani, Vainika Siromani, Veena Gana Gandharva, Gana Rupa Kala Saraswati, Veena Vadana Tatvagna, Gandharva Kalanidhi, Sangeeta Vidhyanidhi, Gana Kaladhara, Veena Vidva Chakravarti, and Vainika Vallabha. On 17th April 1970, Imani was honored by Samskritiki, a uh, Hindustani music organization of Delhi with a purse of rupees 7,000, man patra, and a shield. A special brochure on him was brought out on the occasion. On 24th November 1970, Akhil Bharat Gandharva Mahavidyalaya, Delhi, conferred upon him the coveted title of Maha Maho Upadhyaya, and he was the first recipient of this title. And it was a talk of uh, the town that he was the only Karnataka musician who was given the uh, Maha Maha Upadhyaya, and that too from Akhil Bharat Gandharva Mahavidya, Delhi. So it was a very proud moment for all of us. This title was conferred on a South Indian musician for the first time. This was followed by a felicitation extended to him on 29th December 1970 by the South India Club of Delhi before elite gathering. On 19th February 1973, the All India Felicitation Committee under the patronship of the Vice President of India honored him by conferring upon him the title Chatur Dandi Panditaha and with a valuable purse of rupees 50,000 on his 50th birthday in appreciation of the yeoman services rendered to the cause of Indian music. His tour to Canada and USA delighted the audience in several centers and also at the Carnage Hall at New York with his scintillating play on the Vena and lecture demonstrations, thus widening the circle of vote rays to Carnatic music in the Western world. His recital at the United Nations organization by the Music Appreciation Club was a dream come true for his long cherished desire to render the Vedic Shanti Mantra before the August body. The opportunity most appropriately came during the 1973 Arab-Israeli war. It was described as the concert for peace by Sri C. V. Narsimhan, the UN official, and it proved a unique benediction and the announcement of ceasefire came within a couple of days. In appreciation of his highly intellectual and creative music, the music lovers of Poughkeepsie, New York, bestowed upon him the title Wiener Virtuoso on the 12th October, 1973. He received the golden key from the mayor of Memphis city in honor of his visit to the country. The Raga Shankara Bharanam, played by him on the Veena, won the Asia Rostrum Award for the most outstanding number for the year 1973. The Rostrum was held under the auspicious venue of UNESCO at Alamata. Soviet Union, wherein eminent artists from 30 nations took part. For his eminence in the field of music and contribution to his enrichment, Imani received the Central Sangeet Natak Academy Award for Carnatic Instrumental Music for the year 1973. He won the admiration of the well-known violinist late Yehudi Menuhin, and at his special invitation, he participated in the Festival of International Music Council at Paris on January 8, 1974. He enthralled the elite audience by his concert on the Wiener, classed as the Concert of the Century by the European columnists. 
He had added to the pride and prestige of your music in the World Forum of Music and fulfilled a great mission of an ambassador of Indian culture. For the awards received in India and abroad, Sri Krishnagana Sabha of Madras felicitated him on 1st February 1974 at a function presided over by the governor, Sri K.K. Shah, by conferring upon him the title Veena Dharini Sangeeta Syamala. For the distinguished services rendered in the field of music, Sri Imani received the Republic Day honor of Padma Shri at the investiture ceremony held on 23rd March 1974 at Rashtrapati Bhavan, New Delhi, from the then president, Sri Vivi Giri. An exemplary guru also was Imani. He had to his credit disciples well known in the field of music. Among them were late Chittibabu, late M. Y. Kamashastri, late V. Saraswati, late S. N. Ramachandran, late S. N. Satyamurti, Mr. P. Vishwanadham, and Srimati E. Imani Kalyani Lakshmi Narayana, who's right in front of us, the legal heir of Imani Bani and the Veena, and the efforts that she is putting to bring up another legal heir is going to be my niece, Padmini Pasumarthi. <clears throat> An artist constantly in demand in India and abroad, Imani had contributed a number of recordings for broadcast on AIR. Gramophone, cassette records through HMV, Sangeetha, Enrico, Deccan, and the two long playing records for UNESCO for release all over the world. To say they are innumerable awards, titles, once again, that I may not be able to mention, but I'm mentioning a few of them. So the awards and honors received, and also the positions he had held, held during his tenure as a government official in Delhi. Sahitya Kala Parishad Award, AP Sangeet Natak Academy Award, Honorary Doctorate of Andhra University, Producer Emeritus, All India Radio and TV, Delhi, Professor Emeritus, Andhra University. And the titles conferred on him, Gana Kalanidhi, Vallaki Vallabha, Veena Gana Saraswati, Isai Mayogi, Yara Siriya Chakravarti, Yara Siriya Chakravarti, a very typical uh, a Tamil title. Sangeeta Kala Sagara, <coughs> Vishwa Vainika, Saptagiri Sangeeta Vidwan Mani, Vedanada Panditaha, Gana, Gana Kala Prapurna, Kala Prapurna, Jagata Vainika Sarva Bhauma, Sarva Bhauma, Jagata Vainika Sarva Bhauma, Gana Kala Bharati, Na, Nada Sudharnava and Andhra Ratna. So, um, his awards and achievements have no end. They will just go on for long and long. But we have just briefed a few and I have uh, put them in front of you today. Uh, just to tell you that, uh, to mention uh, a very important event uh, in the year 1973, uh, at uh, Vijayashankar Art Center of Rajamandri, honored him with Suvarna Ghanta Kankanam. So, Suvarna Ghanta Kankanam with the title Veena Vidvat Chakravarti. So, with this, I take the pleasure and honor on behalf of my sister Imani Kalyani Lakshmi Narayana, my niece Padmini Pasumarti, and myself Devi Ramanamurti, and all my family members. Uh, uh, to have been very fortunate to look forward for this very auspicious day of the century celebrations of our beloved <laughs> father. So I welcome you all once again, and I hope uh, all, all that I spoke about my father, I think a few things would have uh, registered in your minds, 
and let us all cherish the moment and take his blessings. Thank you. Shubham Puyat. Devi Ramana Muttigariki. Dhanyavada Mulu. Aneka Dhanyavada Mulu. Yendu Kande. Maha Maho Pajaya. Padmasri. Dr. Yemani Sankar Shastri Gari Gurinchi. Managa Tilian Vishal. Yenno. Yenno Jeparo. Ohatigadi Rendigadu. Wari Piridulu. Ipatikochino and Nigoda. Rendi Pajil Pine on Tayende. Avi. India lo antak manchi birjul lebo. Ani, ini mana Shankar Shastri garni varinch nai. Saraswati putri lo, Shiva putri lo, Mahoh Mahoh pa jaya garu. Wari ki inka birjit dama naga le yen leh dandi. Wari u, ini mana Shankar Shastri garu pilal ga biru potat dama nadi virjas kuna punyam. Me, antharu dandam petukau versen narsa mamba garu. Wele amba garu. Will Amagari Corporation today, Yemen is anchored as a pretty program who bought on Jenna Ranjikanga, Rasignal and a Prekshaka, Anandanga, Walla Ditchaton, Wakata, Renda, Yeni, Wal is usually a Walla Distributed by Guru or Atla Yanta Walla Ditcher, Prapancha Moton, Atlantis and Tacheton, Vida Adishantali Walaman and Dodagal Gutanum, Wari Kumar Tanum, Manolani, Manolani, and then Gora Dodagal Gutanum, while a family, Tanya in a family, India. Ani cepat sendiri. Virus sama ni juga tu, kalian ni juga tu. Bharatiya kalau sama tu, Tanda Krishna juga tu. Mi anda ni terusin orang ni. Ia Tanda Krishna juga tu. Wakasari, makhu, rasuk juga ni perakshak juga wakasari ni. Tanda Krishna juga tu. Gora, dah antara one fourth beri jeli wal sini orang. Induku, ante Bharatiya kalau sama tu, nafah yelah beti. Arasan atau soal jastu nara ini, cagar ay arasan atau soalu, wala nan negar ay perempuan ini ay continue jastu naro, biar elektrik board le ekzekut engineer ay panjat jastu naro, biar missesu, lalita ay emani garu, wala ini perikod ay emani garu, lalita garu international, citra bina, wicitra bina artistu, mandlin artistu, mamul bina artistu, wala amai, emani purni ma, flute artistu, ipuru, wala kan gar jagara. Mikita situ santuru wajikar lu perpanjang perkhidmatan jangan jangan wajikar lu dengar gula ini mana puni ma flute lo awards diskundan de biar amai amai gula international artist wal intlo international artist lu venlo aidi gula naro wal atagar lu itu gula biar amai garu biar gula wari bau marzi biaru sakala kala wala fudu Brudang aku katakan dengan dek gatam wain saru, kanjir wain saru, gatram mandi, gatran erip saru. Inta goppa family, rendi vela pada modelo, setavina, asta setavina, public garden lalita kala tuaran lalu, kandak jay saru, dani ki, ini mana kalian negara, sahaja jawa hincaru, adi Bharati kala samitu baru, kandak jayan dengan dek, dani ki anta mandiri periksa gulu. Ananda padaru, terawati ini macam terawati debah ya, jadi ya apa ya ni, ane semua orang lagi tes kuntu acharu, ini ni korang ipuru, ini dengan cara kerja mana ni, ma bahagianga, ini short tahun ni ma bahagianga, viru, perpanjangan lo, mana koi international artist ni, awal itu mana ni, wal anda ni jis koci, Bharati kala semitu lo, mana tanda Krishna, perci semua macam ko kala karan ni, yakarana sari wal, Delhi lo orang ni, Bombay lo orang ni, yakarana orang ni, anda ni jis koci kala Wari kaciri beti ceram, wari sarman jas pampet ceram ada di, ye negara cheese kuna, punyam. Ada ni, ipuru tanah kisah negara, mana sahabat saya berkarom, inta gopak kala kala lekar mana dengar kociaru, mana sah, sami tu kociaru, wari ni ciri sot karom. Kalian negara gopak waru, mana? Puspa kuchen tu, puspa kuchen tu di. Warni, selamat datang kepada semua korban nama Dewi Ramana Murti Kar. Mereka mudah untuk rawat rendi. Padma Nikar ni, selamat datang nama Dewi Ramana Murti Kar. Viru international gazel singer. Asal gazel sendiri, yatla, yatla pada ali, yatla, akacari yatla cayeri. Anak itu waru mana ku, telugu preksha kelgi, waru neri picture. Yang tua mandiri waru sisilu, anta gopah waru naru, viru lantar gudah. Gopah family ni cik gopah gawat cero, 
గొప్ప గొప్ప కార్యక్రమాలు చేయడం వారికి శ్రీనివాస కల్లూరి శ్రీనివాసరావు గారికి స్వాగతం సుస్వాగతం టీపీ బాలసుబ్రహ్మణ్యం గారి ఘటం వారు కూడా ఘటనలో అందవేసిన చెయ్యి చాలా ఎన్నో కార్యక్రమాలు చేసినటువంటి వారు వారు ఇప్పుడే మీకు వినిపిస్తారు మళ్ళీ ఘటన యొక్క మాధుర్యం ఎంత బాగుంటుంది ఎట్లా వాయించాలి ఏమిటి అన్నది కూడా వారు చెప్తారు శుభం భూయాత్ ఇక మీరు వీణ కచేరీ ప్రారంభించవచ్చు మా అదృష్టంగా భావిస్తున్నాం నమస్కారం ఆల్ వై హార్ట్ యూ వెల్కమ్ ఆల్ రస్కాస్ ఫర్ వ్యూయింగ్ ఆల్ ఓవర్ ద గ్లోబ్ దిస్ మెమర్ మోస్ట్ మెమరబుల్ ఈవెంట్ టుడే వీఆర్ వెరీ ప్రివిలేజ్డ్ అండ్ వెరీ ఫార్చునేట్ టు సెలబ్రేట్ దిట్ దిస్ ఈవెంట్ చాలా గొప్ప సుదీనం ఇది యాక్చువల్గా ఎవ్రీ ఇయర్ వీఆర్ సెలబ్రేటింగ్ స్పెషల్ ఆర్ ట్రిప్ స్పెషల్ వీణా సప్తాహం దిస్ ఈజ్ అ థర్డ్ ఇయర్ Uh, fortunately, uh, it could be, uh, today is a legendary or Maha Mahopadjaya, Dr. Eman Shankar Shastri Jayanthi. It is a uh, centenary birth Jayanthi celebration. Uh, we thought, we requested Kalyani Garu, his daughter. Uh, it is not uh, just a <coughs> Veena concert, it is a special thematic concert. Uh, what is that thematic concert? She will be, <laughs> she will be ending it. హలో ఎస్ అందరికీ నమస్కారం గురుభ్యో నమ అంటే నేను తెలుగులో మాట్లాడచ్చు కాకపోతే దిస్ ఇస్ బీయింగ్ స్ట్రీమ్ లైన్డ్ ఆన్ ది యూట్యూబ్ సో దెర్ ఆర్ వైడర్ పీపుల్ అండ్ దోస్ హూ ఆర్ నాన్ స్పీకింగ్ ద తెలుగు నాన్ స్పీకింగ్ పీపుల్ ఇట్ విల్ ఎనేబుల్ దెమ్ టు అండర్స్టాండ్ వాట్ ఐఎమ్ స్పీకింగ్ sorry if i'm shifting to english <coughs> this is actually this is a normal concert i'm just playing few krutis the first two krutis will be my father's composition apart from being <coughs> a great vidwan that you all know he was a great composer he gave a lot of uh, musical score for films in uh, when he was uh, working with Gemini Studios. I can't name them, it'll go on and you know, there is no end. If I talk about my father, it'll be hours or sometimes it is days. And he has also composed several orchestral uh, pieces while he was working with All, with All India Radio, Vadi Vrinda. And he composed being a Vagya Karaka, that is, he also composed some of the, you know, the Krithis he used to play during his concert. So today I have picked up two small Krithis. The first Krithi will be in the Raga, Niti Mati, set to Rupakatalam. Neera Jakshi Ni Muddu Momu Chupara. And the second that will be followed by this, uh, the first Krithi will be in the Raga Saveri. Uh, uh, this Krithi is in Tamil. Though my father doesn't know much of Tamil, that is the, uh, you know, when he visited uh, Parani, Subramanya Swami temple, he got inspired and he got emotional 
and he started uh, saying Muruga Muruga and then that was the result he was uh, saying Shanmuga Muruga Shanmuga Muruga Un Padam Paninde Naya so the first I will start with these two Kritis and in between I will tell you a little bit about the concept of his uh, the concept pattern I know all the musicians have a special you know uh, the way of uh, presenting the uh, their concerts but here with his vena it is with his uh, that uh, that style that uh, and all with uh, in innovations and uh, in between giving some demonstrations so that the people will understand what exactly is playing so if I'm interrupting in between bear with me thank you today I'm uh, the accompanying artist I'm just telling Kalluri Srinivas Garu and uh, T.B. Balasubramanian Garu both are eminent uh, artists of uh, Hyderabad and they are uh, well known in their fields my daughter Saubhagavati Padmini on the second vena.
that was the title of this program. <coughs> My father's um, concerts used to be, you know, very innovative. He used to stick to the, the strict, the, the principles of the Carnatic style, playing all the major ragas, Kalyani, Sankarabharanam, Thodi, and all in a very detailed way. At the same time, he used to explain. He used to sing also, those who have heard him. And some of the um, uh, YouTube, you know, this uh, recordings, you can find him. He was a very good singer. The gamakas that he sings on the vocal, he used to play on the vena. But the gamakas that the veena could produce, it sometimes it's not all that, you know, a, a few of them are not feasible for vocalist because veena is, as you all know, it's a complete instrument. And he was the master. He was the master of gamakas. He was given a task when he was in the All India Radio, when he was serving as a chief producer of music at uh, New Delhi, uh, he explained the gamakas, the various gamakas. And not only the Dasavida gamakas or the 15 gamakas that we all know, he has added two more gamakas. In fact, one more. Like I told you in my previous uh, concerts, Dribhinna Gamaka, Dribhinna Gamaka, Chaturbhinna Gamaka. This he got inspired when uh, he used to listen to this, um, what do you call this, the guitar and the chord system. And he used to imbibe all these styles 
all the good things of all the instruments of our country, other than our country, whatever they play, whatever the sound that attracts him, he used to uh, put it on the on playing on the veena. Why this veena can play everything? That was his, you know, uh, authoritatively used to say, and he used to demonstrate. And I'll uh, just a little bit. I'll play, and uh, that's a. Vibhinna, Chaturbhinna, the Tribhinna and Chaturbhinna Gamaka, and how he used to uh, play that uh, the chords on the Vena. Nowadays, people are directly, indirectly, there are so many disciples and students following his style, and here and there they do pick up. But he was the ori original uh, inner person who has uh, taken all the innovative uh, things and introduced in his uh, concerts. And he used to explain that was the uh, very uh, a great thing, you know, because otherwise it's very difficult for the, uh, the people to understand what exactly is playing. I'll just do a little bit of it. Now I'll play Gana Murti. This raga has been, you know, introduced. Of course, it is there in the system, no doubt. But my father has popularized this, and uh, not only, you know, just playing the kr the kriti during his concerts. He has uh, composed a very big, uh, um, you know, Brahmar Vinyas, which was sent to uh, that uh, Italia Prick Award from All India Radio. He was working, as you all know, as a director, producer, conductor of the National Orchestra, which by itself is a very, very prestigious place for all the artists to, you know, cherish. And we all love to. I was. Fortunately, one of the members of Vadevaranda, New Delhi. And of course, he has introduced an, another unit in Chennai. So, this Ganamurti, he has composed a Brahmar Vinyas, a day in the life of a bumblebee. How it goes to the uh, each uh, flower and how it sucks the honey and all these effects my father, Imaniji, has played. Imaniji is the only person so far I've known to play mandaram in a very, you know, majestic style that I will do a little bit of it. So with that, he has uh, played the, uh, the, the, the effect of uh, how the, the, you know, the bumblebee gets uh, drowsy. You know, all these effects, he has brought it in his uh, Veena playing, and he chose Gana Murti. Thank you.
next item all these items that I have been just I have started to play here they were all very popular and my father used to uh, play Gana Murthy and they now that I'm playing Kalyana Vasantham Nadaluludai these are all very you know you can uh, see in uh, many of his concerts here, my father has composed another orchestral piece where he has uh, led the orchestra. That means that is Vadivranda is to it used to comprise our fifty persons, like, like uh, ten or fifteen violins, sarods, venas, you know, all you know, flutes, many, all other instruments, all the instruments of our country you can find in Vadivaranda, All India Radio, New Delhi. So he, this concept he had, like you know, uh, it is in the Western uh, concept that uh, yeah, like you know, Vehidu Menuhin used to play th that violin followed by the orchestra. That he used to, you know, like it. So that he has, uh, you know, put it in our, uh, you know, that raga systems. The Vadivaranda Rachanas, that is the, uh, the compositions, are mainly, they are very strict and they are following the raga system. As you all know, orchestration is not our concept. It is the Western concept. But combining our melody, our, you know, our uh, the ragas, you know, playing uh, uh, raga todi is something, you know, it's very difficult. That also he dared to compose a, a ragam tanam pallavi. And Hindu, just know my sister uh, read out few of the 
compositions. These have won a lot of or laurels. Those days, Vadevrinda used to be, you know, something, you know, people used to wait when this 8 o'clock morning time comes. And after the main news, my father's uh, compositions used to play on the radio. And even on a very important days like Independence Day, New uh, Republic Day, and even all the independent, uh, you know, good uh, occasions. So, here he played uh, this raga in a very, you know, followed by the, uh, the orchestration. That I cannot demonstrate here. But I'm just trying to tell you that uh, he has um, uh, played this uh, raga in a very, you know, uh, the strict, that, uh, that pakka, uh, the Karnatak system at the same time following the principles of orchestration. Orchestration is not all the instruments playing together, Akriti is being playing together, no. He would play one piece, another, uh, you, know, uh, you know, violence will play another uh, piece, they'll all be combined. It's a great, uh, you know, uh, thing. I mean, only the Avadivranda of All India Radio, Radio has the credit to have such eminent people like my father and his predecessors one or two people T.K. Jairaman, Pandit Ravishankar you know all my father has composed nearly hundreds of compositions all you know have a thematic now I am coming to the theme, theme. He used to have theme in everything when he plays a Kriti he has got something in mind that's why his imagination used to be different. He has everything he would imagine. He will visualize. He will visualize what Tyagaraja has composed and what he has to say. If he's sublime and, you know, talking to the God, he would speak with his fingers and on the vena. If he's angry, he's demanding, you know, Rama, why, uh, why you didn't give me darshan? He, you know, sometimes he's also, the composer is also a little angry. He would show if everything with the pluck, everything with the right, left hand, because it is in his, you know, imagination. His mind speaks, his soul speaks. So that's the, those, the, 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 the thematic, what our uh, Bharatiya Kalasamati wanted me to say. All his con concerts are thematic. He has got, only thing is he, he might not have explained to the audience at that time, but now I know that all his concerts were fully imaginative, fully, you know, it is conveying something. And most of the audience know. They, they know what actually he means. And few may not know, but then he comes with the, this master, you know, he's a, a great demonstrator, he will explain. So that was his type of, you know, presenting his uh, concepts. Thank you.
As you all know, my father, as a composer, he has also tuned several uh, Hindi bhajans. Mera bhajan, Tulsi Das, Sur Das, like this. And they were very, very popular uh, during his concerts. So I'll play one Mera bhajan just now said to Mishra Chaputala.
Father composed Javalis also. I'll play in the Raga Kamas Manchi Dinamu Nede Cheli.
Just for giving you an idea, his, uh, the last uh, the segment, that is, his concerts used to be three hours, four hours, not less than that. And sometimes it used to be five hours also. I don't know, God alone knows how he sat and the imagination one must have to control the audience, they have to sit. They used to sit till midnight. They won't move. The Conagers, the Vidwans, ordinary people, those who don't know music, they also sit through. And I have seen in one of the concerts in uh, the Rajamandri, the young, small, small children, they don't know anything about Carnatic music or anything of the kind, classical. They used to climb up the you know trees. They were they were told that father would play you know the folk songs and uh, you know uh, the western numbers towards the, towards the end. How they used to wait for five hours? I don't know because they have no background about the music, classical music in 
in particular. So I'm just giving you, he used to play Magudi, that is in Tamil we call it Magudi, Telugu we call it uh, Nagaswarawale. Here I have a small anecdote to share with the viewers. My grandf great grandfather, who was uh, Asthana Vidwan of a particular uh, a Maharaja, because I don't know the name, that's why, and I'm not g giving the name. He was playing, and then those days, no microphones. He used to play in the, uh, the Shruti 6. And vertically, you know, the Vena used to be in the vertical position. And uh, he was uh, playing, and one cobra came, a big cobra. And uh, it was uh, dancing. I don't know whether dancing, it was, you know, nodding. And uh, slowly, all the people moved out, and even the including the king, because he has to save his life. When my grandfather was about to keep the vena and then he also wanted to move, it didn't allow him to do. It was, you know, uh, being, you know, uh, very uh, uh, vigorous, I mean. Then, finally, he took this magudi, and he, he didn't know how much to play. It was going on for, uh, I don't know, Maybe an hour, I don't know exactly. And finally, he says, he was talking to the cobra. He said he was in, uh, doing namaskara to the cobra. We all believe that uh, cobra represents uh, Lord Shiva or Subramanya Swami, like that. So, Nagaraja, I can't play anymore. I'm keeping the vena down. So, the, the cobra took three pradakshinas of his vena and moved, vanished. We don't know where. So from then on, now I relate, maybe Lord Shiva, Lord, you know, Subramanya Swami, Nagaraja, they have blessed a, such a, a great person like my father to the world. This is a small anecdote I'm sharing with you. Thank you.
organizers want some more. <coughs> <laughs> Everybody will play. Mm. Shall I play Vedic hymns? Hmm? Mantra Pushpam. As you all know, Yemeni Shankar Shastri Garu, my father, my guru, his concert used to be a full package from Varnam till Vedic hymns. He was the person who started playing Vedic hymns towards the end of the concert. Not necessarily uh, um, Mangalam was, uh, you know, uh, uh, it, it was actually a uh, practice, but sometimes he used to close the concert with um, Vedic hymns. So also I will do the same. And uh, he used to recite Yagyamal Kya's um, you know, uh, shloka also in the beginning, and he would close with Vedic hymns. In between, of course, the regular pattern will be followed, Varnam, Kritis, Submain, so many ragas in between, Tanam. Tanam, he was always, he was always excelling. He used to have various types and techniques in Tanam playing. Chakratanam, which I don't think so. Anybody would dare that uh, type of uh, Tanam on Vena. And uh, so many things. I mean, you all might have heard him. Those who have heard him personally, they are the lucky ones. Now, the future generation, they'll be hearing the him on the YouTube. That's all. But listening to him is a great boon. It's a blessing to go to his concert. His concert used to be fully packed, whether it is a small town or a city or international, uh, you know, for audience. His audience in US, Paris, Rome, they used to be foreigners. They all come to his room and then find out the greatness of this instrument, and he would explain. Explaining the instrument, explaining the music is also, it's a very important thing. And uh, he could do, because he was demonstrating, and he could speak what he plays. So that was a, was a wonderful thing, and wonderful experience for the audience. Now I'll conclude by Today we have in front of us a very, very great Raghava Charyagaru. <laughs> he is, for me, he is like, you know, thousands and millions of people listening to me today. Because when he is there, you know, I feel that, uh, that honor. I am really honored. I thank our uh, Bharti Kala Samiti once again. And I will conclude. And Thank you. My thanks to my accompanist, Bhadangist, and also Balasubramanian Garu and Kalluri Srinivas Garu. Thank you so much.
తో కూడిన వర్షం వచ్చి వెలిసినట్టు ఉందండి వెరీ థ్యాంక్ యూ వెరీ మచ్ శ్రీమతి కళ్యాణి గారు సపోర్టెడ్ అండ్ వీణా బాయ్ శ్రీమతి పద్మిని గారు వండర్ఫుల్లీ సపోర్టెడ్ అండ్ మృదంగం బాయ్ కల్లూరు శ్రీనివాస్ అండ్ టిపి బాలసుబ్రహ్మణ్యం వెరీ సోల్ఫుల్ అండ్ బ్లిస్ఫుల్ కాన్సర్ట్ వీ హ్యాడ్ వెరీ ప్రివిలే ప్రివిలేజ్ టు హ్యావ్ దిస్ కాన్సర్ట్ ఆన్ ది ఆన్ దిస్ బర్త్డే సెలబ్రేషన్ ఆఫ్ మహామహోపాధ్యాయ డాక్టర్ ఈమన్ శంకర్ శాస్త్రీజీ as part of our annual third annual veena exclusive special rtp saptaham actually since 3 years we started online exclusive rtp saptaham sir aithe uh, today we wanted to do like thematic concert on this special occasion we heartfully humbly welcomes our guest of honor sri world famous hyderabad brothers one of the hyderabad brothers sri raghava chari garu వారి పేరు జగర్మర్ అయిన బ్రాహ్మరు ఎవరు చెప్పక్కర్లేదు ప్లీజ్ కమ్స్ ఆన్ టు డయా సార్ ఒకసారి పైకి వచ్చి ప్లీజ్ కమ్ టు డయా సార్ రిక్వెస్ట్ రాఘవాచారి గారు టు స్మాల్ మూమెంట్ టు అవర్ కళ్యాణి గారు అండ్ ఆర్టిస్ట్ రిక్వెస్ట్ రాఘవాచారి గారు టోకన్ ఆఫ్ గ్రాట్యూడ్ సార్ కొంచెం సైడ్ శ్రీమతి కళ్యాణ్ లక్ష్మణి గారు అదేవిధంగా శ్రీ శ్రీమతి పద్మిని గారు వండర్ఫుల్ సపోర్ట్ మృదంగం ఎక్సలెంట్ సపోర్ట్ అండ్ మృదంగం బాయ్ శ్రీ కల్లూరు శ్రీనివాస్ టిపి బాలసుబ్రహ్మణ్యం గారు ఎక్సలెంట్ సపోర్ట్ అండ్ ఘటం థ్యాంక్ యూ సార్ ధన్యవాదాలు సార్ వెల్కమ్ చూద్దాం ఒకసారి మీరు మాట్లాడే రిక్వెస్ట్ రాఘవాచారి గారు టూ ఫ్యూ వర్డ్స్ ఫ్యూ వర్డ్స్ శ్రీ దేవి రమణమూర్తి గారు శ్రీమతి దేవి రమణమూర్తి గారు ఇందాక
Sri Raghava Chargar ne rondo vaak. Mahan Bhavalu, Mahan Eilu Goppa Vekthi. Maha Shastra, Shankar Shastra. Pidu Veda ante Shastri garu, Shastri garu ante Veda ne. Vari kosu, Veda kosu yu vari putte aru. Wena kau sebut tadi, mana dengan tarim pergi sekarang. Mahan, ni mana tu wena ni? Ni sengkar sastra ada. Kau ni, ni nan, ok kacir macam ni wena bahagian agalian ni. Ikan ada hebat, cagaraya kan sebut. Apa tu MS Gopal Krishna ada? Ni mana tu wena? 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 Ni Hari na bahagia, mahat bahagia. Baru gubari guru cuma antara yang arah itu nak lihat, yang kita lihat. Baru mahaan bahulu, segala sadguna sampan lalu, sahur deh. An, an dekini mana yang cepat lalu. Ante dewa ta, ante ganthalu lakukan cuci, mana kosong cuci, macam sengi itu, mana kicci esy beli per. Adi, 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 anda anda. Mana ante baru ante, baru tarat itu anda. Walaupun suka yang awak jemput tu, ya kerja kau lupa tak mana? Biar kan terlalu kan kau lupa tak? Walaupun kerjanya antara jaya, cepat, sekit, sekti leh nak. Itu begini, anak tu cakap sekti apa nanti? Tapi tu, ada yang sampai tu ni, mak ayah kalau terima je lah tu, ni debay, ni debay, miru? Oh cepat. Ada pasal lele. Sorry. Adik saya sampai tadi kapal itu naru. Baru bawal lagi. Ikan itu naru baru. Shankar Shastra itu ikan itu naru. Bicara itu wancher. Bicara itu orang winter naru. Winter naru. Di winter naru asyik silo. Manantri asyik teli teli je sir. Ingin bawa wine sama. Wine sih. Naa sampai tadi kapal itu kapal itu mana cepat naru. Bicara itu orang naru. Nani kar. Manantri bicara itu orang naru. Baru sastra yang pernah mau lulu. Ibarlah mak kelayan lagi, ama ama kita, entah suka yang mana ente, ente konsep pun tu berlepas orang tu, ni berani ke lepas, hari antar bau ni, betul betul, ada kita ni agit aja, ha, baik jo, antar duduk kan di, antar sana kan di, ye itu mana suka yang, mak suka yang, ini macam jelah, suka ni peradil tu istilah ni, cakap, hai 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 ka, hai ka banyak suka ni pelajaran berlepas, antek ni, antar cakap suka yang, macam ni. Sahal bagun di, perasaan tengun bagun. Manus, manusia ke perasaan tu dia perlu diwar bagun. Enam hari, ha di, ini kali ni malah kadek awal, ha di. Ha, ini kita corona wala, anda tu boleh kita kalau apa manusia kelu tak cendut tu nai. Atman di parit situ lo, mak kelu ni kiri, perlu mak manusia ke perasaan tu dia perlu cari. Di kiri perlu dengar apa dalam, santos, ayo, na terus na bahagia. Atla ke perkawal jual buat apa, entah apa nai. Masih ni masih, ane part tu cahal apa part tu? Part part am berdeng kau ni, mana ni bijak orang tu, macam ni. Entah apa entah macam, santosa. Tapi ma balu serius, ma balu, ma balu entah. Tipe balu entah, tipe balu, tipe balu. Tapi ma pertama ni serius, ma ma ya, cahal apa macam ni nama. Ingat sih, ni tu solo macam orang macam ni, ni bintan, ni binal. Tapuk kau, tapuk kau tu, ni ni macam tu. Han. नहीं नहीं वस्तन नंद बिलोंड कोई साल संतोष नमस्कार जानने वाला दल सर हाँ पिलस हाँ पिलस पिलस हम कड़ा इस्ता ना उक्कनुषम माना उक्कनुषम कराने इस्ता इस्ता श्री चिवकोला बाला जी करने उसार अच्छे माना इराज आते दिलो Raga wajah yang kerja ceru. Hancur kan? Sir, 
Sarah, quick on the channel. Quick on the channel. Side, side, side. Ballot. Ballot. No. Thank you, sir. See, we don't want to miss today's actual birthday. That's why we are going to celebrate this birthday celebration in the large scale. Guru Gardi. So, under Chaptuna, under announcement. On the November 26th, we are going to celebrate a grand, 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 mega Nakshatravina Vibhavari as a tribute to. वर लेजेंडरी हिमानी कारो इन्द्र रविंद्र बार्ती 26 नवंबर अरे ग्रैंड का ये वाला आड़ा वड़े का कौन जैसे हम सारे अंदर रावले आंटे लाइव ला चप्पल मान कर के सर मेरे कुछ अनिश्चित है थैंक यू सर I thanks Sri Lakshmanarayan Garu also, back backbone of Kalyani Garu for supporting the this call. Padhal under ke namaskaram. TV ya? Okay. Okay nisho. K P Rao Garu, Defence Department lo Defence Secretary ka dillo undi retire yaro. Ayna ke float baga vice taro. Ayna mana purva Andhra Pradesh ke. अपूर्व प्रधान कार्य से लेवी सुप्रभाणगर मामोगरो थैंक यू लक्ष्मण नारायण गरु ऑन दिस अकेशन आई वांट टू से फ्यू थिंग्स पर्टिकुलरली अबाउट संकर सैत्री गरु एंड माय एसोसिएशन विथ हिम एंड देयर फैमिली I think uh, as a child I was interested in Veena. At the age of three I used to like to listen to Veena. But opportunities did not come up. My sisters learned music Veena in Vaisak. Then my daughter also learned Veena at a place like Gauhati where you do not know any South Indian music. We had a person to teach Veena. Then we came to Bombay and again to Delhi. I asked my friend S.V.S. Raghavan, who was chairman of BHEL, whether somebody could teach Veena to my daughter. He said, what is there? Sankar Sastri Gauru is there. Straight. So I got a shock. I said, such great person, how can I ask him to teach Veena to my music, my, my daughter? And um, I kept quiet. We had a Megdu teacher. Of course, she knows. Uh, then she pushed, let us go to Sankar Sastri Garu and request him. He made no bones about it. I said, if you are able to pick up, I will teach you. That is the quality of a Maha Mahopadhyaya. Upadhyaya. He said, if you have the ability to pick up, I will teach you. Then he I think tested them for two days. Continue, I, whatever I play, you play. If you do that, I'll teach. Then he taught her for two, three years. I think I was a beneficiary because I used to sit in the classes myself. About two to two and a half years, I used to attend the classes of Sankar Sastri Garu as a witness to learn the intricacies of music, I don't think I picked up anything. What I mean to say is, there is a saying, Saila Iva in Unata Santaha. But Prakruti Komalaha, very tender by nature, they are lofty like a mountain. And tender as a leaf, tendril. That was Sankar Sastri Garu. And I was particularly impressed, not knowing music by style. We were not in those days very familiar with contact mics. He was the person who showed how a contact mic could be used 
to get every nuance in a veena every nuance he would play that was the second thing third thing uh i heard that he gave a concert at the age of 16 in uh, saraswati gana sabha in kakinada that was probably the beginning of his music career and he wanted to join pr college they denied admission because he had not studied earlier something like that but after hearing his concert they took him as a student and of course he did graduation from there and he was good enough to remember my father who was a teacher was a lecturer in the pr college he immediately when i said my surname is this said, are you related to this so such was his uh, guru bhakti and then uh, i was seen kalyani playing probably in mid 70s along with her father today we see padmini playing with kalyani it is a gen- it is a lineage of five generations so far not four but five generations hari achutra hari gadu eemani achutra masastri garu he was himself a composer and uh, i myself came to know some of his compositions he used to play veena vertically up and um, some of our family members had been fortunate to have them as instructors and um, uh, one more thing uh, i wanted to say nigarvi he is a person who had no airs about him very humble person you could walk into his room any time he would engage you for hours with lot of things and uh, nigarvi see high uh, such a high person to be absolutely free of any airs is something great and one more last thing i want to say i think kalyani was yet to be married at that time and we he used to ask me tell me some good boy <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> don't take it miss so he said untarendi he said i want somebody who will see that her music continues there hats off to lakshmi hats off to lakshmi that is why kalyani is still surviving in the field of music and reaching this uh, glorious stage otherwise i know many housewives who do not touch veena after marriage <laughs> that happens in several families but the credit goes to lakshmi nagar <laughs> and finally let their family thrive and produce more veena players i believe it is not only shankar shastri garu i hear so many imanis who are adept in veena once i heard a national program and i expected uh, uh, that there is a national program the player is uh, imani shankar shastri garu they said saraswati i believe it is uh, his sister his sister who played the national program so that, that is the accomplishment of the family and we are very fortunate to be associated with them and wish that they contribute to the cause of veena and music for ages and generations to come god bless them thank you thank you so much sir thank you dhanyavadalu on behalf of bharatiya kala samiti i once again thank shrimati vidwan kalyani lakshminarayan garu shrimati padmini kallur srinivas and uh, tp bal subramanyam i special thanks to raghavachari garu for accepting our invitation as a today's guest thank thank you sir and thank you sir dhanyavad sir thank you all rasikas and who joined this uh, live session as part of this uh, Uh, RTP Veena Saptaham. Tomorrow we are having Vijay Lakshmi Raghu from Chennai. And uh, uh, 
Shri, uh, Vidwan Srikantacharya Gara and Hrishikesh Charigar from USA. They are praying in uh, live. Please do join in the live Vena Saptam session. Thank you. Subham Boya, Danyavadalu.